Hi there, Corey. Lawyers for both defendants just wrapped up a press conference about a minute ago. What we understand is that they pled not guilty to these charges that they're currently facing. Bail conditions have also been set, and both defendants, a $100,000 secured bond. Now, according to prosecutors, Tova Noel and Michael Thomas both failed to perform basic and essential aspects of the job. Their lack of supervision allegedly led to the death of Jeffrey Epstein. The financier was left unsupervised from 10.30 p.m. to 6.30 a.m. in the morning on the night of August 9th, despite two guards allegedly filing reports saying that they did check on Epstein. Now, in a 19-page, six-count indictment, the two are facing charges of conspiracy and false records. In the indictment, it's alleged that the two defendants are seen in surveillance video literally falling asleep on the job for two hours. They were also browsing the internet for for furniture sales, benefit websites, motorcycle sales, and sports news. As this arraignment took place, the head of Federal Bureau of Prisons testified in Washington, D.C. at a Senate Judiciary Committee hearing. Let's take a listen. We don't know for sure what happened at the Epstein case because I don't have the information. But if any staff members out there are not doing their rounds effectively in special housing units, if they are not doing their counts effectively, and if they are signing documents that says they are doing things that they are not doing, not only is that a dereliction of duty, but it's a violation of the law. Do you uh, concur with the, the opinion that it was a suicide? That was the finding of the coroner, sir. Okay. Do you have any evidence suggest otherwise? I do not. How could this have happened? Unfortunately, sir, this thing is, this, uh, the death and the whole situation is still under the investigation of the FBI and the Inspector General's office, and I'm really not at liberty to discuss uh, specifics of this case.